next Halloween tutorial, I have done here a Wonder Woman Sugar Skull. Now, I know there's tons of Wonder Woman looks online, but I have not seen a Sugar Skull version, at least on YouTube. I've seen some illustrations and some photos. That's where I got my inspiration. But this is my take. Wonder Woman was such a great movie. I love Wonder Woman as a character. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. I make new videos every week. And hey, why not? Start subscribe button is right down below. Check out my other videos. Let's get into this one. Lego. Hey guys, wearing clothes so you know. No, I'm not naked. I'm starting out with a face that has foundation, concealer, powder, all that. I didn't show that because it's really not necessary. You can just use whatever you normally use. We're gonna start off with the MAC pencil in the shade white just to trace out the shape of the eyes. I'm also filling in my brows with this white pencil because I feel like color will go better over it. <laughs> the snazaroo face paint that I got in my local craft store I'm gonna take the red shade and start using that to fill in my eye area I am gonna leave my lid and part of the lower lash line area free of this red because I'm going to be adding something else there with concealer I'm gonna go ahead and clean up some of these edges I just want to get the overall shape down that way it's easier to put down the stones and I'm also going to clean up the top part of the eyebrows. Using the NYX Ultimate Face Palette we're going to take the red and use that to set the red face paint we just put down. Premium now I'm going to take the Kali Cosmetics Copper Cream Shadow and I'm going to place that all over the lid. Then I'm going to blend out the edges and I'm going to do the same thing on the lower lash line. This cream shadow is just going to be a base to intensify the other shades we're going to put down on the lid. Now I'm taking that same NYX red eyeshadow and I'm using that to blend the edges of the Kylie Cosmetics Copper Cream Shadow. Now dipping into the ColourPop I Think I Love You palette, we're going to take the shade Rule Breaker and use our fingers to apply that all over where we put the Kylie Cream Shadow. As I'm applying this, I'm making sure to blend the edges into the red. Now we're going to take the shade of My Treat and use that as the inner corner highlight. Taking the black in the palette and a thin angled brush, I'm going to use that to outline the edges of the red. This step isn't really necessary because we're going to be putting down red gems over these lines, but it just helps for a guide. What I'm doing here is taking that same black shadow and adding a little dimension to this eye look. So I'm shading in the corners and other areas and I'm just adding shadow and then blending it out. Some of this does get covered up by the gems that I'm going to put down but I feel as though it gives it a little bit more dimension like I said. These beautiful red gems which I got from my local craft store is what I'm going to use to outline my eye. I'm just using some lash glue which is great to use because they are not going anywhere if you use the lash glue. It's a slow and tedious process but I think it really makes this look what it is and it just really pops. With the Maybelline Master Precise Ink Metallic Liner in Solar Gold, I'm just using this to outline our headpiece. Remember to shake these liners if you are going to use them, that way they're more vibrant. I'm using the same Kylie Cream Shadow to fill this in. It's a little red tone because I'm using a brush with red shadow on it. We're going back into Rule Breaker and I'm using this shadow to place over the Kylie Cream Shadow. This way it really stands out and it makes it the gold color we're looking for. I'm going to take the NYX Matte Liquid Liner in the shade Black and I'm going to use this to make the star on our headpiece. <laughs> We're now going back into that black shade and I'm going to use that to set and intensify our star. I'm also going to kind of blend out the edges just a tad, do a little shading. With the same NYX liner, I'm going to add two lines to our headpiece. I'm going to take the same red gems and I'm also going to take some blue ones and we're going to do red, blue, red, blue and we're just going to outline the headpiece. <laughs> Time for the mouth lines, which I've already done one here. I'm just using the black shadow to do this, and then I'm going to go ahead and blend out this line. I want to darken it up, but also do some blending. I'm blending downwards to make the appearance that it's almost kind of sunken in a little bit. Just keep intensifying that line and then blending downwards. <laughs> Using the NYX liner, I'm doing the Wonder Woman symbol. I'm so sorry that some of this is cut off. I did not realize that I was looking down so low that it would be cut off. A new YouTuber problems. With the shade Rule Breaker, I'm going to go ahead and fill in that Wonder Woman symbol, but unfortunately I am cut off again. So sorry. 
didn't realize. Taking the blue from the Juvia's Place Masquerade palette, I am doing stars on both sides of my face. I'm just using a small liner brush to do this. <laughs> Okay, so here I am adding another line on top of the one we put down, but I don't really like the way I did this, so I'm fixing it, and then I do something else, and then I fix that, and now I'm adding concealer to kind of brighten the area up. I'm also using that blue to go over that line because I want this line to be intensely blue, and I'm also going to blend this out just a tad, but keep it nice and vibrant. <laughs> To start off the lips, I'm going to take the MAC Lip Liner in the shade Cherry and I'm going to use that to outline and to fill in my lips. So now I'm going to go in with the Jordana Black Pearl Metallic Lip in the shade Riveting Red. And let me just say, this formula is really comfortable, it's transfer proof, and it is beautiful. It's metallic and it's, it's gorgeous. Here I show you that it's transfer proof. For the black lines on the mouth, I'm using that same matte liquid liner from NYX. Here I'm just using the same shadows to darken up those lines. I didn't want anything to get lost with all the shading and blending out we did. Now I'm adding another line down on my jawline. I'm using the black shadow first and then going over it with blue. But first I am shading and blending it out. This is where I add the blue to the lines. Finally, time for the nose, and here I am outlining with black shadow. I don't like the shape of this. I do change it. I am filling it in right now with black shadow, but then I go in and rub some of it off right now. Um, I'm also going to add blue to this black on the outer edges, which I'm doing right now, just to give it some dimension and to add more blue to the look. I'm using the NYX liner to outline the nose. I'm also using that liner to add these kind of oval shapes to each side of my face and then I'm going to go ahead and fill them in with the Kylie Cream Shadow and then go over top with the shade Rule Breaker. I'm going to go ahead and outline it with liner. Here I am deepening up those lines again. I mean, I wanted it super, super black. Don't forget to blend, blend, blend. Now I'm outlining my stars with the NYX liner. Try to take your time with this so you don't mess it up because it's delicate work. <laughs> to finish off the eyes, I'm taking black shadow and I'm doing a kind of liner. I'm also going to wing it out. I'm going to take this on the bottom lower lash line as well. <laughs> I'm going to take the NYX Treasure Leaf Pencil and line the top and bottom of the waterline. Lashes are the Nicole Guerrero Collab with Eyelore, some L'Oreal Lash Paradise Mascara. Now to finish off the look, I'm just going to take the black shadow and the blue one that we've been using and just go above and below my collar. And this is the completed look. I really hope that you guys enjoyed watching this video. I hope you have fun recreating it if you do. Please subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in my next video.